Hi guys. So I've had a lot of questions about missing work. So I'm going to kind of go through and then also some assignments that we didn't get a chance to turn in. So we're going to figure all this out together, right? So first of all, I'm going to take a picture of this and put it online for you, but it's just a list of the assignments and whether if they're on paper or on canvas, so you kind of know where to find them. Okay. Um, also, when you're going to go and take your test, this is what the Unit 7 study guide looks like. So it'll be, it's white, and it says Utah's Government Study Guide. And so you can use this on your test. Um, remember that we're not going to be turning this in. There's also another note sheet that is green. It's a green packet that says Utah Structure Notes. We're also not going to turn this in, but this is something that you can use on your test and that should be helpful for you. And then the last note thing is the how a bill becomes a law. Okay. And these are notes you can use in your test. So again, you have these three papers that you can use on your test today. All right. Now we filled out a public policy paper as well. You can use that on, on your test if you'd like to. Um, we're, and it's gonna turn out, we're not gonna turn this in. Um, so don't worry about that. Okay, another thing, um, we were in the middle of doing the writing the bill assignment. We're working in groups on that. Oh gosh, guys, it's really hard. I. We'll kind of see how things go. Um, when we go back to school, I'll have you guys turn it in. Well, I'll probably just have you turn in what you have done. Okay, so don't worry about turning this one in. Um, when we get back to school, we'll kind of worry about that. Um, another paper that people were asking me about is the sustainable development in Utah. It is gray. Okay, it looks like this. And um, you can get a copy of this on Campbell canvas as well if you go into the sustainable development and underneath the title of it there's a, a place where you can click to get a copy of the of the paper and you can either turn it in the missing work thing on uh, canvas or you can also um, turn it in um, I email it to me like take a picture of this and email it to me we did fill this out as a class so I know a couple of you guys had questions like, how do I turn missing work in? You can take a picture of it. Um, and then, uh, you can just email it to me. There's several different ways that you can email me if, um, email the pictures to me. Also, if you go into canvas, there's just a missing work, um, thing. And so I link to the canvas, help, um, canvas help page. If you need help, um, with like how to take pictures and all that stuff. So you just take a photo and submit it here. Okay. So you'll, um, I'm in the teacher version. So of course you can't see, but you'll be able to hit the submit button, um, and turn in, you can do it as a website URL or a file upload. Um, you can do it that way. Okay. So hopefully that helps with the missing and late work and, and takes care of some questions there and about what you'll need to be able to turn in. Cheers.